I'm Kirk Gottebridge. I'm the plant manager of the Times Bay facility. Sean Spencer, process controller trainee at Times Bay Waste Treatment Facility. The job of a power and engineer entails running facilities that generate power or any processes that uh, have equipment that produce power. The job of a power engineer is to maintain the operational facilities that could include hospitals, power plants, large hotels, anything that, any systems that require constant monitoring and operation, uh, the power engineer will be responsible for not only the operation, but also the safety and the maintenance. Yeah, that's right. At Tynes Bay, we have refuse waste to heat boiler and we produce electricity, which we sell to Bauka. But mainly our job is to burn the trash. What I like most about this career is that it's challenging. Um, it's rewarding financially, it's stable, and it feels good to be one of the few qualified in this area. There aren't many Bermudians who hold the qualification of power engineer, and it's something that you know I would recommend a youngster to get into early. The minimum entry level of the Power Engineer program is a high school diploma or equivalent. Uh, from there, the program will involve training in an overseas uh, college where they will gain the skills and the education to gain their fourth, third, and second class Power Engineering license. These classes involve not just theory, which involves uh, based heavily on mechanical engineering, but also hands-on study where they get to operate a power plant themselves learn everything they need to do amongst the safety and the maintenance so that when they return they are fully qualified to act as supervisors at the Times Bay facility or indeed any other facility that may be on the island. My education was done on the job training. I go through TSSA which is a technical standard and safety authority in Canada. They do the examinations and the job has hired someone to coach us through as an instructor and it's basically self-study and you know you take an exam. The skills of a power engineer requires someone who has a bit of hands-on ability, uh, definitely uh, ability to think and solve problems is very vital to the role. Much of the job involves finding problems and then also figuring out how to solve them. Also certain skills and leadership and initiative also required. Again, these are, these are people who maintain processes and the ability to find a solution and act on them quickly are vital to maintain a good operation, a safe operation. The attributes of a successful candidate should be self-motivated and driven to succeed. They should have the initiative. Uh, they should also be uh, technically inclined. Uh, certainly uh, good in math and sciences are, are a great benefit. But anyone who is self-motivated and is, is a team player especially, especially in the power engineering field, you're always on a shift, you're always on a team. And the ability to communicate with people and to bring out the best not only yourself and others is a great attribute to have. I would encourage young Bermudians to take a look at it, at least try it, because there are a few locally qualified Bermudians and it's definitely something that is needed. There's definitely a demand for Bermudians in this field. Uh, Times Bay is one of the few facilities that require power engineers up to the first class level, but there are many other facilities on the island which require power engineers, such as a hospital. Belka has recently taken on the, the criteria of power engineers for their certification. All the hotels on the island also require power engineers to run their boiler houses. There's a great need for power engineers in Bermuda. I started this, say, maybe 12 to 15 years post high school and the math is very, very, very deep. So if you want to get into it, you need to really be strong in math, you need to be strong in study, and you have to be willing to learn on your own. The advice I give to high school students is to uh, pay attention to your math and science classes. Those are the key classes that will gain you the skills required to do well in the power engineering program. And if you're that interested, you can contact uh, your guidance counselor to get involved in the summer student program, which you can come here for the summer, work along with the power engineers, but certainly in a day release program, we also accept students who come along, work for a day or so, so you can find out how the business is run and if it's right for you. The job of a power engineer involves working in specialized environments, and sometimes these can be challenges. Some jobs, especially here at the plant, can involve working in heights, or they're very hot and sometimes dusty conditions. Of course, as a trash plant, you also have the smell to deal with. 
but it also involves long hours. Uh, the, as the, most of these facilities run on a 24-hour basis, shift work could be a requirement. And certainly working long hours is something that should be considered before you consider a career in power engineering. The Road National Training Board is vital to uh, us here at Works in Engineering, especially Times Bay. Their commitment to training people in the trades is really our lifeblood and what will keep us going for generations. And that's the amalgamated in this new training program that we have for power engineering. And certainly will be expanded to include other areas of the trade, such as millwrights, welders. These are things that keep us running. And with the National Training Board support, we see a bright future for us. Well, if you acquire a power engineering license at the third class level, you can basically work anywhere in the world because it's recognized throughout the world. I first got into this when I started to work at Boca. And at first, my first impression was this is not for me because it was a bit overwhelming with the size and the things that, that we were dealing with. But learning it and getting to know it, I realized that this is really something I'd like to do.